brothers. I can feel it now. The Emperor's seal is close at hand. I know where it is. It calls me from deep below. It has chosen us to finish what the other Astartes began. The wolves found and secured this hallowed fragment of the Emperor's living will. Now, we will claim it back, in the name of the Imperium! My brothers, this day will be long remembered. This deed will be written in the Great Hall of Baal, and across the galaxy. Let nothing distract you from your duty. Bring back the seal of the Emperor. Sanguinius is with you! Nothing will stand against us. Onward, brothers! For Sanguinius and the Emperor! is near. When they knew they were trapped here, the Space Wolves knocked it away to preserve its sanctity. We will complete their task and liberate this holy relic from the darkness. Many steadfast warriors fell in this place. They may have marched at the banner of another Primarch, but we will honor them as our brothers today. We stand side by side with the wolves as it should be. Sanguinous! Behold! Ahead! 
lies the sacred reliquary. We are blessed among our brothers. Now, let us succeed where so many failed. We are blood angels. Our victory is assured. Lines of the Emperor. Great Majesty, the seal of the Emperor is ours. Brothers, I wish I could stand with you in this moment. You are touched by the radiance of the Master of Mankind. Hatches secured by the Space Wolves have opened. Perhaps the will of the wolf is still here, guiding us beyond time and death. We have the relic. We must go. Now!
Sanguinius for this glorious victory! The seal is secure. I shall prepare the highest honor guard to stand sentinel around its reliquary aboard the Blood Crusader. We will have much to show our battle brothers when we return to the fortress monastery on Baal. Before the Emperor's light, we remain humble in all things. We serve the Golden Throne and Holy Terror in the name of our Primarch. All the glory is in their name, and so shall it be for eternity. I must admit, grudgingly, that the performance of your Astartes has been exemplary, Blood Angel. Despite our differences, you have done the Imperium's work here today, and your actions will be remembered by all loyal sons and daughters of Holy Terra. The Emperor is watching, and he knows your names. Captain, we're about to enter the hull of an Eldari Void Stalker. My all specs indicate high levels of radiation. Those warships are equipped with very powerful energy cores. If this one is still active, it may just be what we need to break apart that hulk. I sense a powerful psychic force ahead of us. I fear a Xenos Synapse creature still roams the Stygian corridors of this derelict. Only I could oppose such a fiend. Only psychic might can overcome it. Then we go. Brothers, follow my lead. To reach the inner core, it would be faster to take one of those accursed Eldari portals. May the Angel protect us from this abomination! Attention! We are synchronizing all melter-charged detonators across the Space Hulk! When you are ready, we will trigger the explosions! You will have little time to reach the extraction point, Kinsman. So be it. Our deaths are a fair trade for final victory. Indeed. But sacrifice is not needed. An escape route exists. Now go! For the Angel! For the Emperor!
charge is in place. Fabricator General, you may begin. Confirmed. Initiating countdown to detonation. Now, brothers, get out of there. Fall back to the boarding torpedo and disengage. Hurry, before I am forced to pull the Blood Crusader away from the blast zone. Servitors have detected an abnormal signature. A Synapse creature has awakened. Beware, Astartes, for you have never faced the likes of this beast before. Brothers, be on your guard! Kinsman, an inferno is wreaking havoc aboard the Hulk. The fires are encroaching on your position. Time is short. Hulk is splitting apart! 
And so I witness the demise of the Forsaken Doom. It is fitting centuries of study to reach this final moment.
Mission accomplished, kinsman. Return to the battle barge. We have our victory. Costly and arduous, but victory nonetheless. The Forge World's safety is assured. Its manufactories will continue to feed the Imperium's righteous war machine. The Space Hulk is no more. 
torn apart by fire, the Forsaken Doom broke into a million pieces. Debris was consumed in the upper atmosphere of Gorgonum, purifying the Xenos threat with cleansing fire. However, with the prodigious burst of energy came a new, brief warp storm which swallowed the largest pieces of the wreckage. Each has been cast out to become the malignant seed of another Space Hulk. And inside, lying dormant, the lingering taint of the Gene Stealers awaits, poised to infest everything that crosses their path. Slowly, they will grow, capturing derelicts and asteroids in the depths of the void. In time, it will only make things worse. But time is a much needed commodity. Some say it may be the end of it, but not today. Not as long as the Holy Inquisition holds its vigil. Not as long as the forges of the Adeptus Mechanicus continue to burn. Not as long as a single blood angel lives. The sacred seal of the Emperor of Mankind was extracted from its abhorrent sarcophagus and returned to Holy Terror where it belongs. Acting above and beyond the call of duty, triumphing where other chapters had failed, the Blood Angels recovered much more than a precious relic. They brought a moment of hope. A small measure of illumination to the shadow of despair that shrouds the galaxy. Is it, as some suggest, an omen of greater wonders to come? Or a harbinger that the end is nigh? Only time will tell. For the Order Xenos, capturing specimens of the biodivergent gene stealers is an invaluable boon. The greatest minds of the Inquisition and the Magos Biologus will study the arch enemy in detail, hoping to unveil new flaws in this terrible species. As thousands of worlds are under threat of Tyranid infestation, any advantage we can gain will tip the balance between life and death for billions. <laughs>